success in business is a very difficult thing to achieve. And it's more difficult today probably than any other time, despite the vast number of opportunities. And as it relates to finding your calling in terms of what the opportunity or the entrepreneurial adventure is going to be, it has to be linked to something that you are so passionate and crazed about that you're willing to knock down walls and climb mountains and do the things that are going to put yourself in a position of sacrificing so many other things for its success. And you can only do that when there's a compelling underlying feeling that you have that this is something I'm going to fight to the death for. And without that, I think it's going to be a commodity-based experience, not only for the customer, but for you. And I think you can't really succeed at the levels that you want to unless you find that thing that you're so passionate, excited, and in love with. And I think because you've got it along the way, you're going to have to convince so many other people to believe in you and the idea and the opportunity and the struggle and the obstacles that are, that are going to come can over, only be overcome by this passion that you have in which you're going to be able to get people to follow you uh, over, the, over those hurdles. I know it sounds a little bit sophomoric, but it's so true. <laughs> sustainable way unless the management of the company is completely and comprehensively committed to creating long-term value for the employees. And the two are directly linked together. And any company, any management team that turns its back on its people and doesn't share the success of the company with the people who do the work are not going to change the world.